retiring in your 20s or retiring very, very young? How do people do it? How are so many people being able to do it over the course of history? We'll discuss it in this video and how I retired in my 30s. Let's get it. What's up, everybody? You're in the building with your old Uncle Mont, and this is going to be a Life Gains financial video where we help you capitalize on capitalism, and we're talking what can you do to retire really, really quickly, and especially if you're in your 20s, how you can set yourself up to retire by your 30. But before we do that, Y'all know we got to put on these plus seven glasses of sexy as hell, work on skilling up my craft, giving you a better YouTube experience. Again, if you like my videos, you like any of the content on this channel, please subscribe to the channel, click the notification bell, share my videos, and go over to Life Gains, go over to shoplifegains.com. I'm one of the only sites that has real estate gear that you can wear from t-shirts to hats, you name it, we got it. Typically, one of the things that everybody who has wealth has been invested in is real estate. And one of the best ways you can make money and set yourself up for a good long life is to invest in real estate when you're in your 20s. And when you're in your 20s, you get a great compound effect. The more money you put aside, every seven years it tends to double in nine to 10% chunks if you're doing it correctly. What I did and what me and my wife did when we was in our tw 20s, because I met her right when I was like 29, and what we did was we basically lived off one person's income and we put the other, the, uh, we paid our bills with the other income and we was able within a year to save up about $80,000. And I got a friend who started doing that when he was young. When you save up all that money, and you go buy yourself a piece of real estate, make sure you get some real estate that has $30,000 in equity or greater. And by doing that, you set yourself up to, in a year or two, have more equity. You can pull that equity and then you can go buy yourself some more real estate. The example that we did, we did the, we kind of done it backwards. Instead of buying a home, we took the money we saved up and we bought a commercial property, a child care center. Some of y'all have seen my video about what we just did in selling that child care center after fixing it, rehabbing it, putting a renter in there, holding it for five years and selling it. And we walked away with more than six figures in profit. You can do that same thing in your 20s, but the proper steps to do it, you're going to want to have a job and be working that job for at least two years because the banks like to see that you've been in a job for two years. Live way below your means. Save every single dollar you can get your hands on so that you can put big money down as a down payment, all while you're finding a property that already has equity in it. Merge those two together. Even if you gotta do a little fix up to force equity, you still wanna do that. When you also need to be working on your credit as well, or at least developing the credit. So making sure you pay your bills on time, that's really, really important. Don't go higher than 10 to 15% of your credit utilization and at the same time be saving and looking for that deal. And when you find a good deal, jump on it. You know, I would say probably the best place to start if you're in your 20s and you want to set yourself up to retire by the time you're 30 or when you're in your 30s is you find something like a duplex, triplex, or a quad and you take that money, put it down, try to find something where you can get the deal where you're getting 20% higher in your equity and you house hack it, meaning that you live in one of the units and have somebody else pay you rent money in the other units. Ladies and gentlemen, if you do that, you're living rent free, you're getting your bills paid from the other person, all while you're acquiring equity, which will set yourself up to pull some money later on and reinvest. And at that point in time, if that sustains your lifestyle, you can retire the way it has done for me and get up here and make YouTube videos or whatever you want to do and help somebody else. These are all the things I'm doing because real estate allowed me to retire early because I took, took care of what I need to do in my 20s. And you can do the same thing too. This channel is all about helping you capitalize on capitalism. I want to make sure that I'm giving you the information that helped me get where I'm at 
so you can do it. That's going to do it for this video. Please don't forget to like my video, comment, subscribe, and share, share, share these videos. I've got a mission. I was told that I couldn't do all the different things I'm doing on my channel and grow. And I'm here to prove that I can. So I want you guys to help me in doing that by sharing my videos, support me on Patreon, go to shoplifegains.com. If you like some gear in there, buy it. And um, just let me know how you guys are doing out there. And until that next sexy as hell video, I'll see you.